many of you will know the Wakatipu region for its gold mining legacy. But what about the shelite? And what is shelite? What you may not know is that shelite was a huge provider for New Zealand's war effort and it helped shape the township of Glenorchy. We have here the Glenorchy battery. It's tungsten ore, it's brought down here on horses, tipped out here just beside the crusher, and then fed through the crusher. And then the ore goes through that revolving screen which has different sized grating on it. And the oversize goes down into the, the roller which crushes it up to a finer size still. Some of the ore is placed in this box and the whole bin is filled with water. And the operator who does this all day long. It should be pretty tiring work, wouldn't it? <laughs> the shelite being heavy, it's, uh, it's almost as heavy as gold. So it's no trouble separating, the heavy stuff goes to the bottom. That's a sample of water and a sample of shelite. You feel those. Okay, so this is the water. It's a fairly light. It is pretty light, isn't it? And this is the sheet. <laughs> the shelite, which is very heavy. These two, two drums here with the fine stuff is what comes off the table, and these coarser ones are from Lujek. Why was shelite so important? It was important during the wartime because it was a tungsten ore and then the tungsten just tipped into the furnaces and makes hard steel for guns and goodness knows what. Of course, during the war, it was all deemed a strategic material, so, so you it's... couldn't sell it anywhere else. The government just grabbed it and that was it. My dad came here in, in 1942 or so. I remember in his wallet he had for years was a document which exempted him from military service. As long as he worked as long as he you know, As long as he you know, was mining. And did you work in this mine? I have worked here. I've done this, I've done that. I've been, from the time I was a teenager at, at times. I've been away for a while, but now I just sit in the sun. I'm the local scenery inspector, did you know? <laughs> the hard work was up at the mines, underground or whatever you were doing. Sometimes in the winter time or late autumn, frosts all around. Our mine had no sun in the winter time at all. So, I remember going to sleep at night with most of my clothes on <laughs> and looking forward to a shower at the end of the week or so. <laughs> While Glenorchy's shelite industry is a thing of the past and long forgotten, it's being rediscovered as a place to come and learn about our history and enjoy the outdoors while we're at it.